So what's up guys, welcome back to Face of a Matter, it's your girl Jay here, and in today's video, I'm going to be trying out a beauty hack. Now, of course, by the title, you already know what beauty hack this is. This is the doing the whole concealer and highlighting and contouring underneath foundation, doing that part first. Usually, most of the time, you put your foundation down, then you'd highlight and contour, but we're going to be doing it the opposite way. Now, ironically, I used to do this beauty hack centuries ago, honestly, when I first started doing makeup, because that's honestly how I thought you highlighted and contoured your face. I thought you did it first and then helped everything blend in with the foundation. But I haven't done that, uh, done it that way in years, and I feel like maybe I should do it again just to see if I like that way better. Um, so yeah, I've been seeing a lot of people doing it lately, and I decided to test it out here on camera for the channel for you guys. If you already do this beauty hack, let me know down below how it works out for you. So for concealer, I'm gonna be using my Tarte Shape Tape in the color Tan Sand. Now, I was thinking about doing the contouring first, but I think I'm just gonna go ahead and highlight first. So, since this is going under foundation, I wanna make sure that I get enough. I'm not sure if there's like a different like technique to do it this way, but I'm just gonna do it how I used to do. We're gonna highlight that nose, then we're gonna do the forehead. We're gonna do the lip. So just how we would do above the foundation, we're gonna do below the foundation. This feels so weird. Now with this step, I'm thinking you're gonna use like a cream contour. Now if you use powder and you don't do, use cream contour, then this probably wouldn't work out for you because powder underneath foundation. But for my cream contour, I'm gonna be using my two favorite e.l.f. contouring palettes. These are actually foundation palettes, but this e.l.f. stuff all over your face is a dub. Like, no, 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 no. Okay, so because all of this is gonna go underneath foundation, you kinda of wanna add like a little bit of extra. Just because you want the contrast and you know the highlighting and stuff to poke through the foundation layers. And then we're gonna use a little bit on the nose. Let's see how that goes. Y'all know I do not contour my nose with no cream. Mm-mm, honey. But we're gonna do it for the sake of the vid. Okay, so now I'm trying to think, do you blend it out first or do you just go straight in with foundation? I say for the sake of the video, let's just go straight in with foundation. So I'm gonna take medium dark one. I'm gonna just take like two pumps of medium dark one and then like two or three pumps of medium dark two. We're just gonna go over everything with this. And I'm guessing as you're blending the foundation in, you're also blending in the contour and the concealer. But so far, so good. I wonder if I'll even see a difference. That's the gag. Okay, so with my contouring side, I can tell that the contour is kind of poking through, which is good, a good sign. All right, I'm gonna turn the Beauty Blender around just so I'm not adding like dark product up here in my eyeball. All right, going in with the forehead, let's try and blend this in like because I've honestly seen some people just use kind of like concealer all over the face like they just do away with foundation and they get their perfect shade by using their contouring shades so I've seen that being done before let me get up close and see what I'm doing okay so all the makeup that I put on my nose is like literally gone I don't even see where I put the, con the contour stuff so that went away can still kind of see like a little bit of like darkness here as far as like contour but I feel like I don't know I'm gonna go in with powder just to see how the powder looks with it and then I'll make my final decision and I am using airspun loose face powder I'm just gonna go in and set everything but um, I would imagine after adding the rest of your routine like your bronzer and your blush and stuff everything will start to come back together so let's just continue and see how that goes I'm gonna take this Black Radiance Light to Medium Contour Palette. And we're just gonna contour and chisel the cheeks with our bronzer like I usually do. And then we're just gonna take a little bit, just kinda dust a little bit on the nose. All right, team, my loves, this is the conclusion of the video. Honestly, I think it came out okay. I mean, honestly, for me, I feel like I wouldn't do this every day, but I feel like it does work. Um, I mean, of course, after adding your powder bronzer, that's if you even use powdered bronzer over top of like your cream bronzer. I do the most. A lot of us do the most, but that's okay. But um, I feel like it would work if you do add your extra bronzers and stuff on top. Is it something that I would do on a daily? Probably not. Is it something that I will probably add into my makeup routine? Probably not. Mm, I don't know, I really don't care for that, but I know I'm getting a little bit of darkness under here. 
so I kind of like to conceal and color correct a little bit I don't know it's not a bad hack I think if you do this routine I feel like it's a good routine I mean I don't see anything wrong with it but for me in a, in a sense I just be feeling like it just kind of defeats the purpose of you know adding the stuff but I don't know that's just me um, but yeah guys so if you do this beauty hack let me know down below how it works out for you I hope you guys enjoyed this video so as always if you're new I'm Jay and if you're not new I just thank you so much for supporting me with whatever I do here with my channel I love you guys so 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 much go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you have not already we are well growing I'm so happy about that thank you guys so very much for all your support and kind words so yeah again guys if y'all have any other beauty hacks y'all want me to try or uh, any other kind of videos y'all want me to dig down into and be a little bit more creative here on YouTube I feel like I'm super boring but that's okay um let me know down below as well guys I love you all so much and of course God willing I will definitely see you on my next video bye